so good. Good morning, y'all. We're back at it again. So, uh, it is currently Saturday, and it's going to be a productive day. I want to do a really good grocery shop run, and also, I'm trying to make some really big changes in our household. Basically, I want to be a little more sustainable. I'm not saying you're not ever going to see me use plastic or anything, but a little more sustainable, but also lose getting toxic-free products or things that are less toxic. Reason being, I've just been researching a lot, and the amount of toxic ingredients in our stuff is literally insane. So I'm going to try and make some changes. Um, I made a huge order on a new box of cleaning products. I was running out anyways, and I'm like, might as well take advantage and order just less toxic products for my home. I also have animals, so... Um, I'm trying to find replacements for a lot of the things I have already uh, that are pretty toxic. Um, I got rid of candles. I already found replacements for plugins that I have in my house. Uh, they're made with essential oils and they're safe for us, but also for my pets. And yeah, when I do get that box, I'll probably post it either on my other social media pages because I'm not going to get it today, unfortunately. I wish I did. Um, and then I'm also going to just go through my kitchen and stuff and find things that I no longer wish to have that are, you know, pretty toxic and find replacements for those. So today's really just going to be grocery shopping and then finding stuff to replace that I have in my home already. For example, in my kitchen, I have a ton of these just kitchen utensils. These are really cheap kitchen utensils. These are horrible for you. <laughs> The amount of toxic stuff in these things is crazy. So I want to go to wood. I already have some wooden utensils back there, but I just want to replace all of them with just wood or either stainless steel. It's just much better for you. Also, when I mean by like a really good grocery shopping run, I'm trying to make changes also when it comes to but my food that I consume, um, I just feel like a lot of times I get really lazy and I end up just eating a whole bunch of crap. But I want to be more intentional. I want to be more intentional about what I put into my body and just take better care of myself. So I'm going to go to a really nice grocery store and I can't wait and get groceries and really plan out my meals. That way I'm actually eating decent meals during the week because I work during the week and I just find myself snacking and I don't even eat a full meal until like late at night, which is not good at all. So we just came back from Fresh Market. Don't be a weirdo. What are these? Freeze dried peas or um, green beans. Freaking love them. The planty taste to them, the green. Ew, those taste like sweet plantains. My little. I ain't told. Tastes like creamy. It's nasty. It's really good. Well, anyways, we ended up spending basically the same amount here than if we went to Publix. And this is like a whole like organic store. It's where all the old people come. It actually came out around the same price, so I'd rather come here. And I'd rather eat this. You're so good. Try. I'm good. I'm happy with my green beans. Healthy? Not healthy. <laughs> well, I have not eating this. I said this earlier. I was trying to eat better. And now I'm eating chocolate. Now you're using this better, and you're like, it's gross. That's gross. <laughs> I don't like those to even begin with when they're like cooked. Like. Well, you gotta eat better. I eat good. I just don't like that. He was eating this the other night. He ate half a bag of Takis. I don't want to hear nothing. I'm not picky. About being healthy. We're gonna start being healthy though. What do you need? McDonald's. <laughs> Zaxby's is right there. I know. It's all about balance. So. <laughs> I'm eating the healthy stuff. You're eating cookies and Zaxby's. It's about balance. 
You can eat a little crappier one day and then you're gonna have, you know. <laughs> During the week we eat pretty healthy. Even though this week we did not because there was no groceries. So we had like McDonald's and beef overeaters. Beef nachos. Twice in a row. No, we only had it once. Because I wanted to have it again yesterday, but we didn't. No. Instead we got McDonald's. <laughs> I was going downhill. I was like, I was like yeah, we're gonna start eating healthier. We went grocery shopping so we can eat healthier, so. <laughs> what do you do? I dropped a thing of sauce here. I'm coming to On the chair? Yeah, I'm coming to clean it. I don't need to, I guess. Look, I saw him go like if it was a, a, a wet rag, completely soaked the table, then he just started eating a fry on my face. <laughs> In like, what, five seconds? I wasn't even up for that long. <laughs> So we just got back from the grocery stores and I'm gonna give you guys like a little haul of what we got. So the first thing I got was a frozen California blend. So just broccolis, cauliflower, and carrots. Is there peppers in here? Oh, there's red pepper. What? Have you ever seen this mixed with red peppers before? Usually it's just carrots, right? Then I got sweet kernel corn because I want to make uh, like chicken bowls this week, frozen broccoli. I prefer frozen just because of the fact that sometimes it doesn't get used all in time and it'll go bad if it's fresh, so I'd rather just get frozen. Then I got black beans for the bowls this week. And then this is all my husband's stuff. He got ramen. Oh, and then he also got two packs of buckwheat. And then we also went to Sam's. At Sam's, we didn't get much. We just got paper towels, toilet paper, and water. And then they have like the bulk pack of the power cakes from Kodiak. We I eat them like every morning, and during the weekends we eat them too. So it lasts longer. Forget the bulk pack. We got pure Irish butter, sweet tomatoes, sour cream, my oat milk. We got romaine lettuce. Yeah. I got green onions, avocados. I got zucchini and yellow squash and lastly we got bananas and trash bags um i was gonna order from these people anyways they're if you care that's what they're called i was gonna get some trash bags from them i mean i already ordered some trash bags but i don't have them right now and then this same brand they have like foil and a whole bunch of kitchen stuff but they didn't have it over there so i'll just order that so yeah, that's pretty much all I got, so we're gonna go ahead and put that away. Damn, that's a big piece of salmon. I forgot to show you guys, but we also got salmon. I love that. It's a fatty belly. Horace, so, what do you want? So, I'm licking his lips. See all the fat on here? That's good for him. I just finished eating more cookies. <laughs> this, this video, I swear, starting this week, Jocelyn's gonna be on a little healthy train, you know what I mean? But you're in my closet right now because, because, um, there's this store called Freebirds, right? And basically they have like my dream boats. What? My dream boots? I don't even like bo My dream boots, okay? I absolutely love them. So I ordered a pair. I had been waiting for a little bit. I saved up and everything and I got myself a pair of boots. Guys. Look how gorgeous these. They are literally cowboy boots with a heel on them. This is like my personality in a boot. Dark, western, but add a little class. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So, I freaking love them. They're so beautiful. And like the packaging it came in, they came in like in individual bags. I'm so happy with my purchase. So I kind of want to talk about the changes that I'm trying to make. So one of them, like I mentioned, is trying to eat healthier but balanced. Um, I'm not going to like not have McDonald's one day because I'm restricting myself. I just want most of my meals during the week to be healthy and balanced. I find myself sometimes not eating good because I'm, it's just out of laziness or I get too busy and I just completely overlook it. Um, but I want to try to be more intentional about my meals. I also just want to start using more sustainable things. I want to use less plastic. I know you guys saw my grocery hauls and stuff like that had some plastic. That's definitely going to be a work in progress. But I want to be balanced about that as well. So just use glass containers and stuff of that sort. I want to try to eat more organic 
just better food for me. I just feel like a lot of the stuff in the stores nowadays, it's just really bad. So I'd rather support local farms or just put my money towards more organic, healthier things for me. Um, and another goal is just, I want to put my money more into me and my house than into just random junk. So just things that make me happy, invest in me, but also invest in my health. And that's a big thing that I'm trying to do this year and trying to work on. Uh, another thing is using cleaner, less toxic products. So like I mentioned, I went through all my cleaning products. Most of the things I use are toxic. So <laughs> I'm just trying to use less toxic products. So I made a huge order, like I mentioned previously. Um, along with that, what else? Yeah, also just, yeah, less toxic things in general. Um, and that's going to be a work in progress, but I am definitely making and doing my research because, you know, I'm not going to be perfect at it, but at least um, doing things less, so having less toxic products, uh, less waste, all that type of stuff, even though if it's not completely, is still really good. Show you your new shirt. <laughs> I found this. I thought it was interesting. Oh, and then they have this. Off. It's the only one I found that comes in. Uh, Four digestive enzymes, though. Gives it four C allergies. Mega three usually comes from fish oil. Bromelain is good. Trichoderma res. We want to start like adding broth raisin, fish to their raisin. food. And it has like, remember you put like a green powder or something like that? Basically, saw this video. There was this one, and then the same brand had ones, but they came in like... One eighth of a teaspoon, or wait. They came in like these packets, and I wanna... Three I got big dogs. That omega-3 comes from, and if it's from fish oil, four six Yeah, allergies. our dog, I gave him like salmon oil one time, and he broke out in hives, so... Um, I think I'm just gonna stick with this. So we just got back, and we did end up getting the bone broth. But we also got sardines for the dogs. I also stopped by Marshalls because I knew that Marshalls sell, like sold reusable bags. Or I was trying to see also if they have like wooden utensils. But it seems like I'm going to end up just ordering them um, online. Because I'm not finding like wooden utensils that I'm actually wanting. But I did find a ton of reusable storage bags. And then I also found like these. These are like sandwich bags. And then I really, really like these because they, usually they sell these at Target, but they're pretty expensive. And I found them for a pretty good price um, at Marshall's. So pretty happy about that. So we're going to go ahead and give the dogs dinner. All right, so we went to World Market and Home Goods because I was looking for wooden utensils to replace the ones that we have. And I did end up finding multiple different types. These are to replace my spatulas that I have. I don't think that's what it's for, but it's gonna work. I don't know what a stir spat is. It's a stir spat. It's a stirring spatula. Stir? The word stir is. Okay. It's like the. Like I don't really understand like the the ones that have like the spoons with the holes like this. With the teeth. No, they're, they're like this, like a spoon, but they have the... That's a strain, so you could pull like chunks of stuff out and strain. Why couldn't you be a little dumb? Why couldn't I be a little dumb? I'm and then Daniel got a Japanese barbecue sauce. Yeah. Is this like one well or something? Not really, it's just a style of sauce. Got this. Also we got, it's like a soda, right? Yeah. yeah. He usually gets this one. I got two different types of incense because they're actually really good. If you like cooking stuff and you turn one of these on, it fixes the smell issue. And then got matcha Kit Kats because this is basically my favorite candy. It's the only one I'll eat the most of. And then at Marshall's, we got a chimkin. It's so cute. I'm gonna put it on my shelf. I did find as well some more utensils. I got this 
to replace the utensil holder I have in my kitchen because it has like this weird stain on it. I don't even know how I got it, but because of the material. Like the bluish stain thing that's going No, on? it has like a brown. Oh. Yeah, like a brown stain on it. Is that it. one sealed inside? Yes, yeah. it is. The other one isn't. It's not. So I'm pretty sure this is better quality than the other one. I don't even know where we got I the other one. I can throw a hole in the other one. You can use and then I found these. These are Acacia ones. Pretty sure. Yeah, these are Acacia with steel. I was either I was either wood or steel or stainless steel. But if you get utensils like this, it'll like scratch up your pan and stuff. So I didn't get the stainless steel, but I got this and it's stainless steel. Acacia wood and stainless steel can opener. Because if you saw the one I have right now, yeah. that thing is rusty. Well, that one stainless doesn't mean it's not going to rust. No, it's I know. It's going to rust less. But the, but the one I had, the one we got, we've had that for like what? Two or three years. Yeah. And it's like really bad. I'm pretty sure though it was because the other. Um, like dish dryer things that we had, I would it would sit in water and that makes it rust. Okay, that's pretty much all we got. I'm really happy though that I found these. That's why I wanted to come here because I figured I would. Because I was gonna order it online if I didn't find it. Basically, the same price. <laughs> what speed are you going at? Because every turn you take, I'm like this. Going, Slow it down. Going, little, Slow it down. Like you guys, <laughs> if you're gonna watch, I'm gonna be like this. <laughs> That's pretty much, because I was going to order online, and I'm pretty sure it came out cheaper buying it in, in person, because the one I was going to get was a set that basically brought this, and it was like $80, so this came out a little cheaper than that, so. And then the only one that has to get sealed is this one, the rest are sealed. And then, oh, he also got... Before I realized it, it had melted like halfway through it. And the stuff was like all over the stove top. It came off though. It just had to like dry. They even had pizza Kit Kats. Which is you bought the pizza? Oh. No, I should have though. No, that's disgusting. Look, but it'd be fun, like a fun experience, but it'd probably give me a stomach ache. The pizza flavored Kit Kats. turn this way but it has like this on it and I, I don't even know what it's from honestly it has it like all over and I always have it turned this way because I like this side better than with the little bee it just doesn't really go with my house too much but now we're gonna replace it with this one 